Vincent was born in France in 1581. When he was still a young priest, he was captured by Turkish pirates who sold him into slavery. For two years, he had to work hard for the masters who bought him. He converted his last master and was then set free. Vincent was sent to do parish work near Paris. He was a very great friend of the poor. He organized groups to look after the needy. The women nursed the sick and cooked meals for them. Men found jobs for the poor who were able to work and gave food and clothes to those who could not work. Vincent also founded the Daughters of Charity. With the help of these sisters, he gathered money to clothe and feed the poor and to nurse the sick. He built homes for the poor, for the sick, for the aged, and for the abandoned children. Vincent also founded the Congregation of the Mission, or Lazarists, a society of priests and missionaries. He was almost 80 years old when he died in Paris in 1660. His body was found to be incorrupt 50 years after his death. St. Vincent is called the Apostle of Organized Charity. The St. Vincent de Paul Society continues his work for the poor. St. Vincent de Paul's feast day is September 27th. He is the patron saint of charitable societies. O oh God, you gave St. Vincent de Paul apostolic virtues for the salvation of the poor and the formation of the clergy. Grant that endowed with the same spirit, we may love what he loved and act accordingly to his teachings.